This year was a near breaking point for frontline communities. A pandemic that has emerged as a public environmental health crisis, disproportionately impacting black, brown, and indigenous communities. The virality of white supremacy and anti-black racial injustice. A climate crisis that spares no one, felt as a fever pitch for frontline communities first and worst hit. Essential workers without protection, but responsible for protecting everyone extinguishing wildfires, harvesting food, transporting people and packages, cleaning and sanitizing public spaces. Amidst a triple crisis, it may all feel too much, but we not only hold the line, we hold on to hope. Against all odds, we must do both. Front and Center looks back at 2020 with a powerful perspective on possibilities. We officially launched as a nonprofit with the same bold vision inspired by a growing coalition and a new team. We amplified the concerns of communities in a final set of reports through the Environmental Justice Task Force. We passed legislation to reduce greenhouse gas emissions and required investments in equitable transportation. We released a blueprint for the future in our Just Transition report. We created more equitable rules through the nation's most ambitious Clean Energy Transformation Act. We pivoted within the pandemic, issuing a gap analysis, raising over half a million dollars for BIPOC groups. We launched a fellowship program with People's Economy Lab. We convened a virtual summit headlined by BIPOC women leaders. Join us as we pursue a bold vision where equitable governance, renewable resources, regenerative economies, and community solutions are possible.